And as we promised you earlier, we'll bring you the landing of the Space Shuttle Columbia, and we want to go now to Tony Clark for the latest word. Tony? Donna, everything is going smoothly. Columbia is on its way in. It's right now about 11 nautical miles out of the Edwards Air Force Base, about 20,000 feet up. The, uh, you can see the, the shuttle there as it comes in. Rolling on to center line, converging to glide slope. Surface winds, runway 22, 210 at 14, gust 17. All right now, Mission Control is trying to get it lined up. The shuttle is uh, making a 255-degree left turn, which will slow it down, line it up with the concrete runway. That's the runway they want because the shuttle is so heavy. The shuttle weighs right now 225,000 pounds, and Columbia, when the, uh, sh the shuttle is slope. that high, they want to land on, on concrete. It's just about a little less than a minute before landing. The, uh, the camera shot, you can see it Altitude coming in. 5, Mission Control has it lined up for runway 22. Waiting for it there is a people mover, much like is used at uh, many of the airports around the world. It is to get the astronauts, particularly the four astronauts that have been in the Space Lab module, get them off the shuttle quickly uh, and without any exertion. And there are some captain's chairs, lounge chairs, inside that people mover. And it will whisk them away to a week of medical tests. They, they just thought, you can see the, the wheels coming down now. And here it comes. Gears down. Main gear touchdown. Nose gear touchdown. So the shuttle has now touched down. The uh, NASA wanted it to be at Edwards Air Force Base because that's where all of the medical equipment, all of the doctors are who are going to perform tests on the seven astronauts now. The landing itself, the, the deorbit, even closing the uh, payload bay doors, uh, went exactly as NASA had planned. It was a, a beautiful re-entry. Everything pretty much as, as planned. As I say, they were concerned for a time about winds at Edwards Air Force Base, but they said as the shuttle came in that the winds were in fact a little bit lighter than expected, so everything uh, ended up normally. Now what will happen is the people mover will come up, the astronauts will get out, and uh, they will have a, a week of medical tests.